I'm from Edmonton, Alberta, and we moved down here four years ago, and we built our home, and we're actually residents of Honduras now. So uh, we, have, we get to stay here as long as we want without having to leave. Before we left Canada, I was diagnosed with uh, type 2 diabetes. I was taking like three metformin a day just to keep it under control. And after about a year and a half here, I uh, had an A1C done and, and then my doctor took me back to like two metformin. And then about another six months after that, I went down to one. And then after three years, three and a half years, I was diagnosed as not being a non-diabetic anymore. I consumed a lot of fruit, fresh fruit, pineapples, watermelons, papayas, mangoes, constantly, every day I would eat fruit. We go it all in our backyard, but you can still go to the open market. It's the same fruit, but it's all organic. There's no sprays, there's no insecticides. So now, we went back for Canada for a year, and my doctor says, you're not a diabetic anymore. Did Honduras do this for me? Yeah, I would say it did. I'm pretty much 100% sure that it actually helped me get rid of this diabetes I had. But even when I was back in Canada for a year, I would go to the superstore and pick up a pineapple. I can't, couldn't even believe most people would eat that stuff there because it's not even the same. Not even close to being the same. We're both living here full time. We've been here for just over three years full time now. And we're applying for residency, and we just love this place, which is why we live here. Nancy had a cancer operation, basal cell cancer. Yeah. And it cost about, what? $400. Oh. $400 US for the treatment. Our doctor in Canada said she'd have to wait six to nine months to get that operation. And it would have been covered partially in Canada. I don't know what our co-pay would have been. It took days. less than a month. Less than a month for the whole procedure. For, for the whole procedure, from first biopsy to stitched up and, and fixed up, took less than a month. Which, uh, in Canada, I would have had to wait six to nine months just to get the biopsy, and then after that, to get the, uh, to to get get the, the operation, operation, it would yeah. have taken a long time. So, it, no, it's very... Difficult. And what's kind of funny is we met a couple down here, and we told them about this thing, and they said, oh, my father had the same operation in the States, cost him $24,000. And we paid $400. $400. No, the medical down here is good. good. I ended up going to uh, to a hospital in, in Waseva for some test work. Great hospital, nice, clean, did a good job. The facility was excellent. Yeah, it was about the same as what we had in, in Spruce Grove. And yeah, in, in Stony Plain, it was very similar to the hospital in Stony Plain.